Okay, let's see here. True, 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 92%. 92 is a big number. It's the same as 23 out of 25, so if you think about it, 92 is really 2 less than 100. Does anyone ever point that out? I don't even know. I don't know why they would. It's so stupid of me to no even notice that. Because it's not even true in the slightest. It's just, you know, fractions and ratios and all that good stuff. Oh, by he hello! I was talking like I didn't even... Oh my god. This is Argon Matrix. Welcome to episode 52 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn and Castle DDD. Time to get this one underway. Seems like it'd be a pretty important one. And I think it's probably the last one before the boss. Because I see that boss door down there and I'm ready to take that on. God, I love this music. This is probably one of my favorite tracks in the entirety of Kirby, really. Okay, I get this. You ride on the cannonballs. That's neato. Huh. Because normally cannonballs in video games, they're like just obstacles to be avoided at all costs. But here, like they still explode on impact. I can see that. And they probably crush you against the wall. So they're still pretty volatile. But in general, they're a lot less uh, hazardous than regular cannonballs. And it seems like you need to use them. I can imagine this could get pretty crafty later on, though. I know I'd get pretty crafty with this if I were making, like, a homebrew or something out of these. Mm. What? There's, like, a portrait and it's the waddle. Okay. Not sure I fully understand. I imagine something will happen when I take out all of these guys. Oh, hey, look at that. I was right. <laughs> look at that exclamation point. I haven't seen one of these things in actually quite a while. Cool. Is this how I'm going to be getting the treasures of the freaking place? Hmm. That'll be pretty innovative if... Oh, it's the patches. Okay. So the treasures are still going to be in those uh, little pink boxes? Fine by me. I love those things. I've grown accustomed to them. You can't take them away from me now. Ooh, and I want those really bad. Something tells me that, like... I don't know. Something tells me about this level that it's going to be hard to get gold in it, but people... Have, I haven't heard anyone, like, complaining about it in the comments or anything like they did with uh, Cloud Palace and stuff. But I don't know. Something about it just... It feels like a bad omen is in the air and that I'm going to get screwed over at the last second or something. That's just my prediction, though. I don't even know. Okay, another one of these. Slightly more convoluted this time, though, I see. Aha! Uh -huh. Not too much more, but... <laughs> there you go. Yeah, oh, can I get... I want to get up there! Crap! Oh, wait, I can, I can still do it. Duh! Okay, sweet. Huh. <laughs> that was stupid. Alright, and now this fella. Man, they're so high up. Oh, God. That was crazy. I don't think I lost any beads, or at least not many. Oh, crap. I'm not sure if you actually get all of the beads back once, like... Like, if it drops all of the beads that you lost, or only a fraction of them. I'm not totally sure when you get hit. And I can't be bothered to count or pay attention to that or anything. I'm not that, uh... I'm not that hard-ass about it, I guess. Oh, wait, this... The treasure is here. Okay, Castle DDD. Someone put a lot of effort into this model of Castle DDD. They certainly did. <laughs> That's crazy. They give they give you the treasure of the castle inside the castle. That reminds me of when we, when I went to the freaking Alberta like government building or whatever. I forget what it was called, uh, but it was in Edmonton a few weeks back, and they had like this Lego model of the building inside the building. And it's like holy crap! Like someone put so much effort into that. That's crazy. And there we got bronze, nice. Are things going to st start ramping up in difficulty now? Oh my god, these things are like thwomps now. Explosive thwomps. I don't know if they'll actually crush me. Oh god. Oh, I'm dead. Oh yeah. But you know what, I got some invincibility invincibility frames. Not many, but it's enough to recollect most of my beads. Mm, ooh, I want up there, man. I really do. I'm going to get up there for the last thing I do. Why are there, like, gears and stuff in the back? Is this a factory or a castle? You gotta pick one, guys. Because, like, those are pr two pretty common, like, final area type things, are factories and castles. You can't have both at once. Might as well throw a volcano in here while you're at it. Yeah, and I was smart not to use the ground pound to get down there faster, because I would just smash through the floor like a madman. Like a mad man. A mad man? No, a madman. Oh! Wow, that was close. Oh, am I, am I gonna have to use, like, strategy with these guys? Like, not screw myself out of being able to reach one? Because these guys are... Like, you can use their explosive in very strange ways. Crap, I screwed myself, didn't I? Didn't, I totally did. What the balls. Wait, maybe not. 
Oh, maybe not. Wait, no, I think I still did. Crap, oh my god, what the hell are you doing? Dude, I could have had... Far... Wait, maybe I can still get this guy. I think I can still do this. Well, you know what? It's probably just a patch. I'm just gonna hope it's a patch anyways. Because, like, the way these things work, generally... Like, the first one was a patch, the second one was a treasure, so if they're going in that supposed pattern which isn't really a pattern because it's not defined by the factor of three, then I'm left to assume that that one should be a patch. Oh, nice. So I'm just going to hope that, and I don't really need the patches, except to, like, to, show out, to show off where they are. And if you already know it's there, it doesn't really matter if I get it or not, does it? I should hope not. And dude, I'm messing up with these cannons. I swear to God, sometimes these things are harder to time than the ones in Donkey Kong Country. But not that much harder. Alright, now let's mess you guys up. Aw, oh, yeah. That was perfect. The perfect throw right there. Ooh, there's a door, and I need to get to it. Well, that was easy. That was the easiest puzzle I've ever seen. Are you kidding me? You know, it just occurred to me that I might actually be recording the final battle of this game in this recording session. Because, like, if I'm, if I'm assuming right, this should be the level before the boss. So, I don't, I don't know, I'm still, I'm feeling pretty jazzed to do, like, more than just this level, so, we'll see. Right, I'm gonna collect the beads just to be sure that I got them all. And then, uh, unmask this for the second treasure, DDD's robe, that looks so cozy. This luxurious robe is amazingly comfy, even if it is a little big. <laughs> I'm sure you could order, I wonder if that, that actually exists, a DDD's robe. Because I would totally buy that if it came in my size. But DDD's a little bit, uh... He's a little bit girthy, so... I don't know, I'd have to, like, get extra small in comparison to his size or something. Still, though, I would totally nerdgasm over that. Think, think, think geek.com if you're listening. <laughs> Product ideas for you. It'll be an instant bestseller, I guarantee it. Well, actually, I don't want to guarantee anything like that. Can I go up here and get something? I'd imagine I'd be able to. Let's see. Oh, yeah, sure. There it is. Queel? Queel? What the hell is queel mean? I was trying to say cool. Or like cool or something. I'd go with queel. <laughs> queel. What the frick frack, man. Oh, hello. It's been a while since we've seen any of these guys. These weird slug things. Uh, yeah, I'm totally decimating them, though. Didn't we see one of these in like one of the opening cutscenes of the game, even? Wait, no, that was a purple one of those guys. I remember that because I just saw Slim Kirby's part one of this game not too long ago. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah, so that other one that I missed was probably a patch. I just have to hope that I don't... Because if it continues in this pattern still, then there's going to be one more of those rooms that contains the last treasure or the music disc or whatever you want to call it. And hopefully I won't screw myself out of that one either. I'll have to be a lot more wary. I don't know. But I can only imagine the way you could screw yourself out of those if it was his, is if it was bombs again. And I don't know why they'd use like the same enemy twice. But wait, didn't they already use the same enemy twice? Didn't they use Waddle D's twice? I don't even know. I can hardly remember. Oh god. Mm. This looks a little bit Kaizo-ish for a Kirby game. <laughs> this is like freaking Bull Bill jumping. What are they making me do here? This is crazy. Oh, I want that last beat. I really do. But I'm not going to go for it. Because I think I'll be able to manage gold without it. At least I pray I will. If I don't get utterly screwed over here, I should be fine. But... Oh, you never know. Stranger things have happened. Alright, last room. Let's go. Or supposed last room, anyways. Man, that's far out of the way. It is bombs again! Oh, crap. Okay. I've got to be extra careful. What the hell? What the hell? Okay, I'm not being extra careful. Definitely not. Uh, what the... That's f that's the furthest from extra careful you could possibly be. What the no, don't don't disappear on me now. Oh uh, okay, I think I managed to salvage most, if not all, of those. Okay, how am I gonna do this? I see I can't reach that guy just by walking. And is it the same on the others? Yeah. Except oh shoot. There's a thing above that guy too. Okay, I think I can still manage this though, if I just place the bombs just right. Let's see if I can do this. I'm gonna wait for this guy to be in just the spot. I'm gonna grab him. I'm gonna hurry my ass up there and throw it. 
Okay, that should be good. That opens him up. Now, get you. And throw it up there. Dude, no! Throw it up there! Shit! Shit! I don't suppose I could still get up there. No, I can't. Well, I screwed myself. What can I say? Can I get this one at least? Oh, come the frick frack on. Oh my god. Well, I guess I'm coming back for that. Shoot. Those bombs, I tell ya, they're nothing to be taken lightly. Oh, damn. I guess on the way back, too, I can show just me getting that patch. Just So I guess there is a kind of a silver lining to it. I'll get to show off everything. Oh, that's a big one. Is this, does that just mean there's a lot of... Wa oh, no, there's an actual big Waddle D here. What do you know? I suppose he's not any harder than the, oh, than the normal ones, though. Definitely not. Alright. As long as there aren't too many more hazards in my way, I should be able to get out of here with gold just by the skin of my teeth. That's a funny expression, by the skin of your teeth, because, like, your teeth don't have skin, but it's still, like, just... Because it still, it still makes sense, because, like... I don't know. It just does. It's one of those things that you can hardly explain. Mm. Oh, that was worthwhile, I suppose. How do I get down there, though? I want down there, man. I want down there, because I see a little expl exclamation thingy. Am I not getting down there? Alright, let's find out. Oh, wait, maybe this will open that up. Yeah, probably. It's been a while since we've seen a zipper that looks like a frog's mouth still. That's the most. That's one of the stupidest things I've ever, I've ever said in a video. Seriously. Oh, hello. Are these bees going to disappear if I take too long? Probably. And I might take... Yeah, they are. Look at that. Oh, I still got a lot of them. Alright, oh, jeez. These spikes, man. I'm horrible at maneuvering these cannons, too. Alright, I guess that wasn't too bad. It looks like I do make it out of here with gold. Well, whoop de freaking do Oh, don't go over, don't go over, don't go over. Yes. Man, that's beautiful. Well, that's DDD's castle. We're going to have to go back in a second for the third treasure and, I guess, the second patch, too. Because why not? I mean, if you have to go back for one, you might as well go back for the other. Am I right? Let's see here. Yeah, look at that lonely freaking... Oh, that lonely music disc box. The Bells of Joy patch. That's cheery. 